I'm going to read you a poem about the life of Christ, a very short poem called A Cross to Bear, and it's about how we're all bearing our cross just like Christ did at his time. A Cross to Bear Each man and woman everywhere will have themselves a cross to bear, be it grief or famine's hunger, illness, loss or struck by thunder. All shall feel upon their back this giant wooden cross is stacked. Their knees will buckle, legs will tire, and their foreheads shall perspire. The cross will strike at any time, so seek the reason, not the rhyme. Not the whine, the yell, the shriek, but seek what makes you strong, not weak. Stand up tall and bear your cross. Be unweakened by your loss. Hold yourself in times of trial, inwardly, constantly smile. Flex the muscles of your will and run with cross atop the hill. Then at the perch you will declare, I'm stronger than this cross I bear. So what does this poem mean? It means you're carrying this cross, just like Christ carried his cross as he walked through the towns and was vilified by everybody around him. But he carried his cross and he carried his peace until the day that he was crucified. And even at the final end of his crucifixion, he said, Father, forgive them, for they know not what they do. And the only way he was able to access such wisdom, compassion and sympathy for those around him was through the portal of inner peace. Through peace, the soul's layer of wisdom, strength and love lies. But without peace, the entrance is closed. So through your trials, hold your peace, hold your smiles and release.